Okay, on my way to Floral Park. Just passed by this apartment complex. Not sure if it's senior housing or not. It's here in Westchester. They care about us. But enough of that. We're going to be talking, continu continuing the talk. And yet I don't even know where to begin, because I already talked about the, the hardware and the software. I guess I'll just go over configurations and specs from the lowest end to the highest end. The netbook will, will have a <laughs> one gigabyte of DDR3, advanced versions of DDR3 RAM, one DIM, single channel, 60 gigabyte ultra ATA, or maybe it's just ATA, hard, hard drive. It would support more than 128 gigs, since the modern technology has made it like so that Newer hard drives could be supported to 160 or 250, but now we have SATA. We have those drives. Here we are, what a spectacle. Floral Park. The Park of Flowers, as it's really, that's what it means. and Jaguar processor, probably running in the four gigahertz base to the five gigahertz, or at, around to six gigahertz boost. That's what the netbook would be running, dual core or quad core. So at least the processor is good. And up to like the, at least the processor works, it works out pretty well. It's much, well, it performs very well. compared to other netbook processors. Then a discrete GPU, probably like a, a Polaris low-end GPU. <laughs> Arctic Islands. And then, the second one, next tier up, is 2 gigabytes of dual channel RAM, DDR3 RAM, 16 gigabyte SATA, and then, the dual or quad core bulldozer, or Jano, Jano U series chip. Mm -hmm. I think the low end you should use Jano and then the next tier up with 4 gigabytes and 250 gigabytes should. I think those should use the. I think those those ones should use the Trinity processors. Next one up is gonna be an FX drive processor. Bulldozer first gen, 8 gigabytes of RAM, 500 gigabytes of storage, and a 6 core Mars 5, 12, no, no, not 12. It's 1470. Thank 
cold. I'm back here in New Hyde Park. <laughs> we got this. Next pick up, this will be the workstation type. For the real pro, we use a C30, C32 socket. Mm -hmm. Have eight cores. We're up to eight cores. It was, it start with six, I think. Have 16 gigs of RAM. Two terabytes of storage. I think those would use the SAS hard drives. <laughs> And given what Xenotos 3 said, I might make all these just solid state drives, given if I have the, have the mm -hmm. supplier. Mm -hmm. There's going to be lots of other specs, too.